Yes. I didn't look in the mirror, except when I was in the makeup trailer. You know, I, I hi, how you doing? Uh, it was, it was dark, it was challenging, it was miserable, but it was also beautiful and wonderful and life-changing. You know, uh, I learned a lot and lessons that I'll take with me for the rest of my life. Uh, so, yeah. There are a lot of physical changes Yeah. this. And it's not the first time you've done this, but yeah. you had to do it very quickly. Yes. How did this, was this a discipline that really helped and really drove you in this? Well, I had walked down a similar path before as far as the weight loss goes for Requiem for Dream. And as far as approaching dark material, that no stranger to that. So that helps, you have some tools. But I hadn't made a movie in five years. You know, that's a long time, almost six. So it's almost like I started from the beginning again. And I think that the five years off touring with 30 Seconds to Mars, uh, playing shows all over the world, I think that taught me a lot. I think it taught me how to, gave me a lot of experience. And I think it enriched my life and made me a better actor as a result. There's already talks about an Oscar nod. How do you feel about that? Well, uh, terrible. <laughs> it's absolutely horrible. But no, it's incredible. I mean, the conversation about an Oscar nod is like, I'm looking, looking behind me to see who you're talking about. It's surreal. It's it's beautiful. It's a wonderful thing. I mean, to celebrate art and life in this way, uh, I couldn't think of any greater honor. It's wonderful. When Thank you. Prepare you. for a night like tonight yep. when it was obvious insanity and you're celebrating a film. Sure. There's also the, the business aspect of walking a red carpet yeah. and being prepared for that. What goes through your mind before you come to an event like this and look down and see that you're going to talk to 50 people? You know, I don't even think about it. I think I sent my mother an email. Uh, we were talking about something else in the car on the way here. And, you know, I did roll down the window and talk to some of the folks in line and uh, thank them for coming. But, uh, you know, what? It it's just not very intimidating to me. I think it's we're all, we're all doing something really fun. We're sharing art. We're sharing creativity. And I think that's a really wonderful and worthy thing to do. I mean, there's so much... There's so many dark things in the world, you know. It's nice to take a look at, at the potential that we all have. And I think this film really does that. It's a film about survival, about hope. Uh, so, you know, I feel really happy and proud to share it with everybody. Thank you, guys.